Hey guys, this is my first official YouTube video and I wanted to share with you some of my favorite vegan, non-toxic, gluten-free makeup products and hair products. Everything that I'm going to show you in this video I got from my absolute favorite store, Wild Ginger Apothecary, and if you live in Sarasota, Florida by chance, you have to go there. It's in Gulfgate. She's amazing, the owner, Nicole. I absolutely love her and I go there for all of my beauty products as well as when I want to get someone a nice birthday gift or anniversary gift or Mother's Day, Father's Day. I mean, you can do, you can do it all there. Everything she does is uh, completely non-toxic, mostly vegan, and awesome. The, everything really works well. So, you might be asking, why vegan makeup? What difference does it make? Um, without going into a whole long thing about this, I let's just say uh, animal cruelty is not cool. So you can still use all the same products and they can work just as well and you can bypass that whole animal cruelty thing. So I will go ahead and start by showing you a couple of things that I use. I tried to use everything that I'm going to show you on my face and hair today um, so that you can kind of see what they look like. Um, as you can see, my hair is naturally straight, so I curled it a little bit, um, but I usually don't have anything in it, and it doesn't really stay very well. So the first product I want to tell you about is um, by a company called Little Barn Apothecary, and it is Jasmine Ocean Water. And even when I don't curl my hair, if I just spray a little bit of it in there, it gives it some texture, and it's really nice. Um, totally vegan, totally cruelty-free, non-toxic smells amazing even when I don't need it to texturize my hair so then I'll just spray it in even if my hair is up just because it smells so good. Absolutely love that, would recommend it to anybody. So good. It's kind of like a salt water spray. It's like gives you the beach hair. So you can kind of see that effect. It's not super super crunchy like hairspray or anything. Uh, next would probably be my mineral foundation that I absolutely love. Totally vegan, totally cruelty free, non-toxic. This thing I've had already for months, it's gonna last forever. I love it. A same company, which is Lily Lolo, I think is the way you pronounce that. Um, the bronzer, again, absolutely amazing. Works, it's gonna last for like a year or more maybe. I use a tiny, tiny bit in it and it works perfectly. <clears throat> Mascara. Mascara is such a hard one, especially to find it vegan and non-toxic and all of that. Um, same company, Lily Lolo. I absolutely love this. Um, Nicole at Wild Ginger will tell you I'm in every few months buying a new bottle because I'm obsessed with it. Let's see, what else? Deodorant is a huge one. All of the deodorants out there um, are so toxic with the aluminum and, you know, petroleum and just stuff that you do not want in your body. And I tried a lot of the natural ones. Um, the crystal spray was okay. It, it worked for a little while and then you would sweat and it would stop working. But I have never found a deodorant like the one that I found at Wild Ginger. Uh, Schmitz, I think, is the brand name. Uh, Ylang Ylang and Calendula is my absolute favorite scented one. She's got a few different ones. She's even got a fragrance-free one. And there's nothing bad in here at all. And it works, that's the most important thing. You can put this on and you're good for the whole day. It's like regular deodorant, but non-toxic. And vegan, of course. Mm, let's see, lipstick is another one. Really hard to find a good lipstick that's vegan, if you like to wear lipstick, which I do. Um, this I got at Wild Ginger. Uh, Gressa, I think is the brand name. And the color is Regal. I really love this a lot. Sometimes I'll put it on with a lip brush and sometimes I'll put it on just with my finger. It's kind of just like that on the inside. Really easy to use. Love it. And that's it. I've got a couple other products that I bought from her, but I'll probably do those in a separate video. So yeah, if you don't live in Sarasota and you're not going to get to have the honor of going to Wild Ginger Apothecary in person and meeting Nicole, which if you live here, please go. She's just so cool and the store is amazing. I've Nobody I've ever brought there doesn't absolutely love it. You're still in luck because she has an online store. And I will go ahead and link that in the description below. Um, check it out. 
buy some of her stuff. It's all non-toxic. You gotta double check. Most things are vegan. Like I said, not everything is, I don't think, but um, most things are. Everything in this video definitely is. And um, I hope you enjoyed my review. Thanks guys, have a good day. We going? Can you see my whole head and from here to here? Yes, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to focus you. Is it, is it gonna go out soon? All right. Hair products. See how my hair's looking right now. I'm out in this humid weather. I'm gonna cut all of that out of the video, don't worry. Why are you looking like that? Because you have two hairs that are like... Is that better? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay.